Our program is a three-year program with the first two years being focused in diagnostic imaging and the third optional year being focused in nuclear medicine. Throughout their, their two or even possibly three years here in, in their residency, they'll be covering rotations across all modalities, giving the opportunity for hands-on experience and training across a variety of vendors at our various hospitals that we cover. So when it comes to the residency program, I think some of the things that make McGovern a little bit unique are uh, the exposure the residents get to the clinical operation. I think residencies kind of operate on a spectrum ranging all the way from being more or less pure testing all the way to being more or less like a pure postdoc type position. And I think we strike a pretty good balance between those. You get the opportunity to work um, with a lot of um, top-notch medical physicist. Uh, you get the opportunity to work at the cutting edge medical um, equipment. And um, this program, um, the residency salary here is one of the most competitive in the country. In each rotation, there's going to be a faculty assigned to uh, the resident. Um, we will be mentoring them, uh, we'll guiding them, and giving them all the, the training that they need to become board certified uh, medical physicists. As a resident, I'm being trained in across all of the imaging modalities. Um, I have an education curriculum I go through, um, learning how to do all of the testing. And uh, besides that, I also have some academic duties, such as uh, teaching residents and a bit of research. The residency is tailored to your um, own goals, and the faculty is very good at exposing you to different opportunities that will help you achieve those goals. They give you the tools that you need to be able to excel in whatever it is that you want to do, if that's in your clinical training, um, different clinical projects that you want to be involved in, or any type of leadership opportunities. The faculty and residents are regularly together, um, and the faculty's involved in a pretty hands-on um, level with the residents, allowing us to tailor their education um, to whatever the resident's strengths and weaknesses are. The program here is, is very warm and friendly. They allow you to develop um, your plan. They allow the customize your plan, your residency, to suit your future career goal. Coming to work every day with a group of people that is incredibly supportive and welcoming it just makes your day even better as well. You will learn things in many different ways and you also have different personalities that you can kind of model your own to find you know, role models that you might like. McGovern is special because of the flexibility they allow their residents. We're well connected with other institutions throughout the medical center. There's a lot of opportunities available to us and you're able to organize your time so as to specialize. The Department of Radiology is one of the main departments as far as uh, clinical medicine in the university. and. Uh, Radiology pretty much touches every other branch of medicine. You see the benefit of your work applied on a daily basis. Part of our job is to uh, try to improve patient care. Um, so I think that's something that's very, very, very interesting to me. What I like about it is we can actually make difference and we can actually provide a safe environment for our patient and also for the employees who work in the hospital. There are two primary hospitals that you, you rotate at. Um, one is the Memorial Hemen at the Texas Medical Center. You also get to work at a, a smaller hospital. LBJ is a local Harris County hospital. And in addition to that, during your, during your nuclear medicine rotation, you also get to work at the MD Anderson Cancer Center. Uh, one cool thing about the residency is we, we kind of serve a variety of different centers. Um, we follow our physicians to outpatient centers. We serve the two hospitals that our physicians serve. And uh, in addition to that, there's um, some breast imaging centers and other things of that sort. So we're able to get the experience largely of an in-house clinical physicist, a typical academic hospital physicist, uh, but we also get to feel the consulting life and know what it's like to uh, drive to an external site and be responsible for what's there. Our resident will have a lot of opportunity to look at the clinical set up and then clinical procedures. Our high clinical throughput uh, is one of the assets as far as uh, seeing different types of exams and patients. We as a group value teamwork and that's something that we try to pass, pass on to our residents as well. Our faculty really include us in some of the higher level decisions made in our section. 
um, when it comes to uh, recruiting for our institution, training of different people, managing interpersonal conflict. Uh, you'll get to see how that is done from a high level um, that maybe some junior people aren't exposed to everywhere. So uh, this would be really useful training in my opinion if you wanted to take on a leadership position in the future. Texas Medical Center is the largest medical complex in the world. It has more than 60 institutions on this block and typically it has more than 100,000 employees every day coming in and out doing their jobs. Being in the Texas Medical Center is a very unique opportunity because you can have a lot of cooperation with anybody on the block and also TMC is one of the places that's highly concentrated with the medical physicist including both radiation oncology and diagnostic medical physics. Living in Houston is definitely a lot different than many other places in the United States. It's pretty large and spread out, but this has a lot of advantages as well. Um, if you want to live in the city, you know, there's lots of opportunity for nightlife, um, sports, really good restaurants. Um, but another thing is, is if you want to live out in the suburbs in a more quiet area, that's also an option as well. And the commute's never really too bad. Life in Houston uh, is really uh, nice. It's wonderful living here. My personal favorite is food. There are a lot of options of restaurants all around town. Um, there's art, there's sports, nightlife. It's a very, very vivid city. One thing I like the most about uh, Houston is the diversity. There is something for everyone. Houston is a large city with multiple culture. And that's the one of the reason I moved here and it's good for, uh, for family. If everything goes on smoothly, on the third year, in the third year in May, the residents can pass their ABR certification, and also the third year for nuclear medicine or clinical nuclear medicine, they will be qualified for uh, the Society of Nuclear Medicine Board certification. It's very good for them to, uh, to go out looking for a job. The number one thing I like about our residency program is I think that we give our residents sort of the opportunity to operate almost independently as faculty by the time that they are hitting their, their late second, early third year. Uh, so I think they kind of are able to hit the ground running coming out of their residency. Um, and I think that, that is achieved by different programs to varying degrees depending on where you go uh, and I think that that makes them very competitive in the job market. I'm becoming very confident in my in ability to practice independently in either consulting or as a hospital in-house or hospital-based medical physicist. Mm -hmm.